Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another look using the Wet n Wild Wild Heart palette. Look number 35. Can you believe it? So many looks done with this palette. Today's look reminds me of Grapefruit and it doesn't show up like the pink in the outer corner in the pictures but it is very bright and vibrant and the camera had trouble picking up that pink. It's so pretty mixed with the peaches. Let's get started. First up, I'm using the NYX Ultimate Eyeshadow Primer to prime my eyes. No powder under the eyes to catch fallout because this palette does not have a lot of fallout. And of course, we're using the Wet n Wild Wild Heart Eyeshadow Palette. And in the first row, we're using the Matte Peach Shade. I love using this shade. I'm so close to hitting pan on this shade as well. I'm taking this on a fluffy crease brush and I'm applying it in the crease. I'm kind of doing a kind of windshield wiper motion and a padding motion to build up the crease color. Next up, second row, I'm taking this matte pink shade and this shade is so pretty. I've done a one eyeshadow look with this pink too. It's so pretty. All these videos will be linked down in the description box as well as the playlist will be in the cards. So definitely check out the other looks if you haven't already. There are so many beautiful looks. Now this one is more on like a dense pencil brush and I stamped that in my outer corner. Next up, I'm going to be taking this beautiful coppery shade in the second row. And I'm going to foil this with Hard Candy Primer Spray. Because if you didn't know, this is a wet and dry eyeshadow palette and you can use them wet or dry. So I'm applying that with a flat shader brush on the lid. And I just kind of paint this on the lid. And I will also pat some on the top of that as well. This shade is absolutely stunning. I'm going to do a little bit of blending and adding some more color in the outer corner there and in the crease. Just blend everything down. Next up, I'm taking in the first row the second shadow, which is like a vanilla shade. It's matte, and I'm using this for my highlight. This is going to help blend down the crease and the crease is going to be able to blend up into the brow area now seamlessly that's such a beautiful highlight shade this palette is super well rounded in terms of lid shades outer corner crease crease shades um, transition shades highlight like really good palette I'm taking the shimmery white in the eye on the palette and I'm going to place that in the inner corner and on the lower lash line I'm putting the peach shade. And I'm using AOA Studio Gel Eyeliner and Seize the Day to do my upper rim. And then I'm using the Santee Gel Eyeliner. This is just an orange pencil from Shop Miss A in my waterline. And Essence Lash Princess Mascara because another day that I just didn't really feel like wearing lashes. That's the finished eyes. For lips, I used the Hard Candy All Matte Up Lip Crayons. And the white one is the primer. And the colored one is like a nude pink. And it's in the shade Blushed. It's such a pretty lip crayon. These are fantastic. If you ever see these back in stores, grab them up. So that's the finished look. I hope you enjoyed the makeup tutorial today, found it helpful, and try, will try the look out for yourselves. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos like these. And don't forget to check the description box as well as the cards for additional Wet n Wild links.